Hello guys, Mini VMAC here, and today we are playing Doki Doki Literature Club with Local Desert 2. Just Monica. Just Monica! And yes, I did leave you hanging on this, so we're gonna continue. <laughs> no pun intended. Uh, I'm giving you so happy! Saria hugs the cookie. Jeez, Dana, what happened? Just eat it! Just fucking eat it, you little bitch. Sayori rapidly tears open what the wrapper the and takes a bite. Sayori's option or Natsuki's option? I'm doing Yuri's option because I know exactly what happens. A Wait, but does he want to explore the unknown? <laughs> <laughs> She just like she fucking devours it like a wolf. It, it's like it's like there was a needle in the cookie and she ate it. Oh, you you put core for. Yeah, basically. <laughs> Sayori suddenly glass her hangs over her mouth. <laughs> like she literally bites a ton off. Don't yeah. Go for water. Oh, just one cookie. I've been eight in seven days. Natsuki takes a bite of her own cookie. Ah, that looks really good too, Natsuki. You, I, you literally just gave you one. Can I try it? Jeez. Beggars can't be choosers. But no, it's chocolate. No, you gotta say chocolate with the demon, demon voice. But yours is chocolate. <laughs> chocolate. Yes. Chocolate. 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 I could just see the recording break right now. Like, imagine if we had an editor. It's like, it's like, what the fuck? Why is there, why is there this spike on this audio? Why is there this huge spike? Well, that's because John decided to. Yeah, come Mike. Yeah. What are you? Sorry, sir. This is a Christian video. So. No I'm swearing! Are you done talking? Are you done? Are you done, Fox? Yes. Yeah, anyway, what do you think I what do you think I gave you that one? Fine. Fine. Still, I'm really happy that you you shared this one with me. <laughs> Sayori gets out of her seat. <laughs> oh, <I'm not> <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, oh, you smell amazing. I didn't actually mean to say the line. I didn't even know the line was on jeez. I get it, I get it. Stop creeping me out. <laughs> So can reach you up to nudge and say Ori off of her. <laughs> say Ori suddenly leans down and takes a bite of this. Cookie's cookie. Hey! hey. Did, you, did you just seriously do that? <laughs> I'm actually Mouth feeling. Mouthful say Ori trots away to safety. <laughs> Yuri and I laugh as well. <laughs> You bitch! Jeez, you're such a kid sometimes! Hey, why does that give me flashbacks to Pokemon Black and White? Monica! Monica! Monica, can you, can you tell us who you are? Hey, what is it that you need? That's who you glance around. Monica isn't in the club room. Fucking isn't Monica. that a good thing? Fucking Monica. No, it's not a good thing, because you don't know what kind of shit she's up to. That, 
Or she couldn't even be in the game right now. She could be, like, running around in the code. <laughs> I was about to say, she could be fucking around with Sayori's mental health, so we know it. Mmm, I'll just get used to it. Why do I have this suicidal thought and it pop it up? Uh, fucking Monica. Where's Monica anyway? Screwing around in the code. I mean, she's just going out. Oh, she's just hanging around. I'm gonna take a stab in the dark. And, uh, and I don't want to break my neck uh, doing some tricks, but I'm thinking she's up to something. Good question. Did he heard about her late being late today? No, but I know about when she was late right now. Yeah, I haven't either. Oh, um... That's very unusual. Her existence is unusual. So you really give me that moose. Of course she's okay! That's up in- She just probably had something to do today! Where are you? Eh? No, wait, that's not me. Eh! 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 These graphics! Eh! You don't think she? No. Huh? Just cause, like, you have a photo frame of Monica, and like, it just cut. It just like it switch. It just like it flips back to you with a boyfriend on it, and you're like, no. She has. She has a dick. <laughs> I wanted to be surprised. She might have I'm a ball sack. I'm terrified of my life, but I'm gonna continue anyways. Not worrying about what she actually has in mind. Probably more terrible than all of us combined. You're the one who has the dead. At best, I mean, what? <laughs> That's true. Excuse me. <laughs> Suddenly the door swings open. Ah, it's a monster. Somebody once told uh -oh. me the world was gonna run me. Sorry, Monica I terrifies me. She's just bought that shit. It comes in, you know, like it like breaks off. No, it's like the store. The door swings open. Ah, it's a monster. Monica walks out like, oh, well, I'm not too far off. Standing on the edge. Oh, super ah, there you are. I didn't mean to be late. Yeah, I bet you were having a bunch of fun in that code. I was in a huge orgy. <laughs> anyway, hope you guys weren't worried or anything. No, we're just sitting here enjoying life that you're probably gonna awesome. soon take away, anyways. But I'll play along just because I care. You really need to. <laughs> Look at just club over the board for natural. So strong willed. Actually, I'd rather she be late than actually be on please, time. Please have a boyfriend. Please have a boyfriend. Please have a boyfriend. Just want her. Just want her. Just want her. Just want her. Bitches. I need boyfriend. What? What I? What on earth are you talking about? Monica. Quizzily glances at me. Yep. <laughs> ah, never mind that. I'm just gonna walk out now and never come back. Goodbye, Monica. It's like hold no. my mouse hostage. I'm sorry. Where are you going? Nowhere. I'm sorry. We're gonna. Sorry, that's gonna be a delivery delay. Boop the nose. What held you up, anyways? I held you up anyway. 
Where's my nose? <laughs> it's that one pixel. Ah. Ah. That's that's not ah. pixel. That's just a dent in your computer. Oh, it lost periods and it was study hall. Oh, I thought it was something else. What? BJ's or something? Let's be honest, I kind of lost track of time. Uh. <laughs> oh, sorry. History. You would have heard the bell. All right. There's it makes you. no sense. It makes no sense, though! I would have heard the bell in rain, at least! I must have not heard it. Bell's practicing the pi practicing piano. Such a liar. Hear it later. Piano? Oh, wait. The, the end. I don't know why you Never mind. Music as well, Monica. Uh, Wait a minute. Really... John, what if she was late because of the piano and that recording was exactly why she was late? Remember at the end, if she plays a piano at it the end. It is. That basically is the song. That That's the reason why. That's why and, she was late. And not late. to mention, she, she directly told us that she knows where to play her in her first poem. Yeah. Kind of fun. Just kind of started recently. I always wanted to learn piano. Lies! Oh. Oh. Ever since I watched Shrek. Some. So cool. Play something for us, Monica. Okay. Stop. Monica looks at me. Stop looking at me. No! Maybe once I get a little better, I will. Go away. Your no! eyes. Your anime eyes scare me. That sounds cool. Also, I look, I look forward to it more, more in another get. life. That's so. Okay. case. I won't let you down, Fox. <laughs> Great Fox! Monica smiles. Right, where did the others go? And probably boo she probably boo she probably she probably knocked them off like of her ass alone. All the players disappeared. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> I've been practicing a whole lot recently. Your line. And I love the night. And I really love to share the chance to share once I'm ready. I see. In that case, best of luck. I thought that said best of luck for a second. Thanks! No, I didn't miss anything, did I? No, Kinda. we're just. Oh, sorry. We you missed. About how Jon Snow died. <laughs> You missed on how we were having so much fun without you. Yeah. Yeah, I was talking to my wife, though. No, not really. I mean, someone that doesn't exist. I choose to leave out Sayori's mischievous escapade. I'm sure Nesuki will end up complaining to her anyways. Looks like everyone has already settled down. Sayori somehow already finished her entire cookie. To be honest, those big cookies are not that much anyways. I would have eaten it, like, within five or six bites. Or maybe three. Yuri is back to her book, and Asuki disappeared into the closet. We have no re- We don't know why she did. Hey, Yuri. <laughs> ah. I suddenly noticed that Yuri is reading a different book from the one we've been reading together. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. Oh no. I was just kind of waiting for you. It took so long. Ah, if that's the long. case, why don't we go ahead and get started? <laughs> you waiting, huh? Yes! Let's. 
actually have a request. Mind if I make some tea first? Not at all. But... Thanks very much. Just don't cut yourself. There's one thing that I can make in my my rooms on me here any better. A nice cup of tea. Mention for yourself as well. Yuri stands up and makes her way to the closet. I follow and watch as she retrieves a small Yuri, water come out the from closet. the shelf, the kind with the filter inside, and a knife. Can you hold this for a second? She just shanks you. Sure. Shanks me. Oh. <laughs> Yuri hands me the water pitcher and also fetches an electric kettle. Plug this into the teacher's desk and then we'll go get some water. Where the fuck's the teacher? She walks past me and sets the kettle down on the teacher's Wait, desk. That Probably it's Monica's Where were desk. the other students? No, oh. Monica is the teacher. She's the only one there. Oh. I simply watch her movements. To my surprise, the way she moves really contrasts her speaking mannerism. Especially because of her long legs. Yuri appears elegant and metaphorical and thick. Yeah, thick! Thick! Get it? Get it. Hey, may I have the water pitcher? Wait, I don't know. If we have to go may into you? If we had to retrieve water, wouldn't that mean we kind of already had it? You're asking, like, if we had to go to a sink to get water, but we already had it. Maybe there's a fountain in this class. Maybe use tears. Maybe use saliva. Maybe Why use urine. I don't fountain? fucking know. Maybe use, maybe use jizz. Anything, really. Uh, Just don't question it. Get back. Uh, I might as well walk with you. No. Yeah. Why not? Can we go then? Yeah. <laughs> Where are you two up off to? <laughs> Monica. Eh? Where the fuck did you come from? Eh? Uh, we're just here and gonna make some peace, so. I didn't realize how weird it sounds to explain this to Monica. We're just filling the water pitcher. Oh, hey. Sorry. Just a bit curious. Say curious in a satanic voice. But I'm just a bit... Curious. Yes, there you go. Curious. <laughs> That's basically sounding like her. That's kind of a one person job, isn't it? Uh, yes? <laughs> That's. Monica, please mind your own fucking business for once. Psych. Oh, Yuri. Psych, that's the wrong number. Oh! Also, I found out. I found out. Uh, someone posted a video of the original snake, snake from the third game. Was that Taco Bell? I, I gotta send you that one. On what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Why do you have to tell me there's somewhere something wrong with helping me? Helping me involve Fox and Claw back to three. <laughs> My mouth gapes. She just said that to Monica, and she knows and she doesn't even know she'll be deleted if she said that to her. <laughs> I... I suppose there's something wrong with that. Monica did nothing wrong. <laughs> Let's go. 
Uh. 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 Hold on, I'm getting a random phone call. Uh, I'm not gonna answer it. Yeah, probably, probably not the fucking uh. answer the call. Very quickly exits the room as I follow. Once in the hallway, she suddenly puts her forehead against the wall. Once in the hallway, she stabs herself. Shush. Spoke without thinking. How could I say something like that? Yuri. I just... Something about the way and she said that. Already. Alright, now Monica's fucking with us now. It made me feel so irritated. What's wrong with me? No, Yuri. I think you did the right thing. I wasn't expecting it, but it was also not right for Monica to judge people like that. Um. Fox. Fox. How, how come even though when I do something bad, you're being nice to me? Because nothing that you do is bad as you make it seem in your head. Nobody's perfect. We oh have yeah. So we can't always have hide them away. But you always amplify things in your head. Your mind turns a light rain shower into a hurricane. And that's why Hurricane Katrina happened. Happen. She cheesy, yeah, I had to bring that up. Hurricane Katrina or like Hurricane Tortilla. Ha! Fades away. No. You hate me for something as terrible as that? Why would I hate you? I can't hate I can't. someone for having emotions. Yes, you can. What kind of friend would that? What kind of friend would do that, Monica? And for nineteen fifties. Friend, say. Friend zone. Friend zone. Friend zone. Yeah, he, as soon as you said that, I hear Leo say, "Dang it!" Dang it. <laughs> uh, um. Yuri lifts her head. Fox, I really like being friends with you. Ha <laughs> You've been friend zoned. Thanks, Yuri. I like being friends with you, too. I feel kind of awkward saying something like that. But I'm doing my best to help Yuri feel better. Anyway... Oh, yeah. Shall we go? Yeah. Yuri and I walk to the nearest water fountain. Once we fill up the water pitcher, we return to the classroom. And it's on fire! Oh my god, it is it's on fire! Fox, do you like a oolong tea? I don't I even know what the fuck that ball. is, but okay. Oh, uh, yeah! Pig. It's the pig from Dragon Ball. She killed him. Anything is fine. I don't mind if I put my jizz in as well. I mean, what? Very well. Here he sets a temperature on the kettle to 1,000 degrees! 1,000 degree degrees! Cheese up! Let's see what it can cut! Now it's time to get the teapot! You really do this properly, don't you? No. Of course. Why would you do it not properly? You wanna die? You wanna fucking, fucking die? You can do any of us when I'm making tea for others. Hold on, I gotta pull something up real quick. Bitch. My lovely... Folder. This folder that I gotta delete some recordings because. Skip. I guess I can't erase that one. I'll just rename it to. No. Oh, fuck. Uh, let's just go back to. Even if I'm not an expert on tea or anything. Ho ho ho! 
In that case, you would be even more impressed. Ah, uh, perhaps I will. Perhaps I won't. Don't disappoint me. You're suddenly going in there. Should we get... Yuri fetches a teapot and begins measuring the tea leaves. To my surprise, she even starts humming a little to herself. It's like quiet. <laughs> you must be in a good mood now. I'm never in a good mood when I'm playing this game. I'm always scared. They are known to the scheme. This is game that will curse me. And the spookiness will happen. It's a spooky game! I'm going to hell here! But hey, it can't be that bad. Come on, John, where are you? It's all this voice of myself. Is that so? I was letting it show. And you noticed. I was doing a bit of thinking. And I decided I would try expressing myself a little bit more. I think it'll be fine if you don't. It turns out I'm not very... It's not very hard for me to do. Whenever it's... Who's around anyways. Uh... That's great, Yuri. Just don't push yourself too much. You're always worrying about me, Fox. It's very endearing. That's... Yuri wasn't kidding. I don't even know if I can keep up with this. How much Yuri pour a cup of tea for each of us? Fox, I have another request. Do you mind if we sit on the floor today? Eh, why is that? It's a bit easier on my back. I can read with my back against the wall rather than bending over at my desk. How about you just sit back and hold the book in your hands instead of having to read it on the floor? Oh, sorry if I didn't realize. No worries. I just have back pain fairly regularly, so I do my best to manage it. Is that so? I wonder why that is. Most, it's most likely because of my... Uh, my... Your posture, right? I always hunched over like that while reading. Yes. I have terrible reading posture. So that's why we should sit on the floor. Fair enough. I'll go ahead and get the book. I retrieved the book from my bag. Ah, I have some chocolate as well. It's a bag of small chocolate candies that I kept hidden from Sayori's candy radar. I take it... I take it since it goes well with the tea. Yuri and I sit against the wall, teacups at our sides. As if a sink. We assume this same reading position as last time, each holding one half the book. Except this time, our bodies are even closer to each other. I can't see too well. <laughs> Yuri slides closer until our shoulders are touching. How am I supposed to focus our reading like this? Yuri was al always kind of cute, but when she's being less apprehensive. It's almost more than I can handle. Your teacup. Yuri hands me my teacup, holding it with my hand and not holding the book. I end up in a position that makes it even harder to focus. Because now I need to worry about making sure I don't accidentally touch her chest. Meanwhile, Yuri Crush. hasn't noticed Crush. a single damn thing. She wears her intense reading expression that only, that, <laughs> that only presume the world around her has faded away. 
I use all my willpower to focus on reading. After a few minutes, I finally managed to relax a little. I put my teacup between my legs and fumble with the <laughs> chocolate wrapper. Ah, sorry. I briefly let go to the book to finish opening the wrapper. You can have as much as you want. Uh, uh, that's eat it, skinny bitch. That's okay. I'll take any. Eat it, you thick. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> Are you sure? Oh. Fuck it, it's my cheat day. I touch it and like it smudges on the pages. I can just clean it later. Ah, you're right. Didn't even think about that. Oh, my bad. No need to. No, oh, that's you. I need to apologize. Uh, oh yeah, coming from her. Your oh, turn. Okay. <laughs> Are you sure? Okay. Okay. Of course. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. I love Ooh. the animation in the background. Yuri opens Ooh. the book with both hands. She holds it so that I don't have any harder of a time reading from it. But as a result, her left arm is practically resting on top of my leg. <laughs> well, in that case, Yuri is already totally focused on reading again. I take a chocolate candy and pop it into my mouth. Then I take another chocolate and hold it up to Yuri. She doesn't even look away from the book. She simply parts her lips as she, as if the situation was completely natural. But that means I can't stop here. I apprehensively place the chocolate in her mouth. It's tiny. Just like that, Yuri closes her lips over it. Eh? Oh, that's you. <laughs> Yuri's expression suddenly breaks. The, the hell are gay, bro? And I just... It's not gay if you're a girl and I'm a guy. Peace Yuri looks at me like she needs to confirm what just happened. Uh, uh, um. Fox. Sorry. What do you say? I guess I shouldn't have done that. Huh, that's... Well... You were just helping. It's something that friends do. No. Y yeah, uh, yeah, I give, I give my friends... Oh, right? Yeah, I give I... my friends chocolate all the time. Hey, hey, John, you want some chocolate? What? what are you gay or something? And you're just I said, at do you, you want thinking? chocolate? No, John, it's like I said, do you want chocolate? And I force you down while trying to put it in your mouth. It's like, and, and that's no, hella good. I can see like, you doing that to you. I'm like, okay. Because, uh, uh, I'll just go, you want, you want some chocolate? And you're like, what? What are you gay or something? Like, eat the yeah, pretty much. I mean, not really in this kind of context, but. Oh, yeah. I, no, no, it doesn't need context. That's all it was. Just chocolate. Yeah. Then. Don't need to stop everything. I see. The situation has gotten really tense. Yuri tries to return to the book, but I can tell just by her expression <laughs> she, that <even laughs> she, she can't out of focus her. My heart is Dude. pounding. I nervously take another chocolate between my fingers. She this just time lets out a loud fart. <laughs> How did it even come to this? I never asked Yuri for this. doesn't avert her gaze. I notice her chest rising or falling to the rhythm of her breaths. I raise my arm. Oh. Slap! Yeah, bitch slap. Like before, you already parts her lips, but it's different this time. I take the chocolate and place it in her mouth. I feel her hot breath on my fingers. Okay, I'm real. Oh my Jesus. god! Jesus! Go away, Monica. 
You, <laughs> no, you have too much of a good timing. That was that was actually really that was actually really scary. It's like I'm like, oh my. Okay, everyone. I'm like, Jesus. Okay, everyone. And that's where we stop here. Like, comment, and subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video.